what is up my fellow YouTubians, this is your favourite redstoner here, Mr. Legacy, back at you once again with another Redstone 101 episode, and I believe this to be episode 9 of the Redstone 101 series, and isn't the new intro that I have for my channel really cool guys, really sexy, it was done by a guy called Zero, I'll leave the link to his channel down in the description, you should check him out, he does really cool intros. So for those of you who are new to my channel, I welcome you. And I'd like to inform you that Redstone 101 is a continuous series which I run on my channel where I take PC concept designs and I make them work on Xbox. So today I'm showing you the secret staircase. Um, it's a really cool design, uh, very compact, very cool. I'm going to show you how it works here. It didn't take too long to kind of make this. A friend of mine, XD98, helped me come up with kind of the uh, design around it. I've seen concepts of this on PC and I'm just going to show you here how it works. It's very cool, it's pretty much seamless and... Yeah, it's a really cool thing to put in your world. So, um, let's get on to the tutorial, and I hope you guys enjoy this. So, guys, I'm not going to overcomplicate this tutorial for you, and I'm going to go in three easy steps, very slowly, so you'll know what to do. So, what you're going to need for this is redstone, redstone torches, redstone repeater, regular piston, sticky piston, and two blocks of your choice. I'm using pink wool, and I'm using sandstone. Now, you place down two sticky pistons in the middle, as I'm showing you right now. You place another uh, regular piston, one block, one high apart from it, on either side. You place down a redstone repeater, and you set it to the second tick. You place another redstone repeater beside it, and set that to the second tick. You put another redstone repeater in front of it, and set that to the third tick. Now we're going to place down another redstone repeater facing in towards the sticky piston, and we're just going to leave that as it is. We're going to get our wool, and we're going to place down two blocks of wool. We're going to dig one hole deep underneath our regular piston and we're going to place some redstone and now we're going to place down a redstone torch and another redstone torch. Now between two pieces of wool we're going to place down one piece of redstone. Next we're going to get our redstone repeater and we're going to come over to the other side and we're going to place a redstone repeater underneath the piston and we're going to place one facing in towards the first sticky piston as I'm showing you right now and you're going to set that to the third you're going to set both of them to the third tick now you're going to join up all of your uh, redstone repeaters as so so this part is probably the easiest part so what we're going to do is we're going to dig down two more blocks and um, beside the redstone we last placed and put a piece of wool in there and then a redstone torch on it we're going to go up one more piece of wool and then we're going to put a regular piston on that then we're going to put a redstone repeater facing in towards that hole on the third tick. We're going to place down another regular piston. Now we're going to get our redstone and we're going to uh, put down one piece of redstone. And we're going to have the redstone leading into redstone repeaters and we'll leave them on the first tick as they are. So guys, so far our build should look exactly like this, I've added in some stone steps, and I've already noticed I have an error with this, so I'm going to have to fix that. I go over and I destroy this regular piston, I build down one block, and then I put down a piece of redstone and put down a regular piston once again. I'm going to put in some sandstone as I have done here, this is necessary for the moving of the actual blocks. Now I'm going to dig a trench just like I've done here, and place down... Um, Two redstone repeaters, leave the first one as it is, but set the second one to the fourth tick, and then connect it with some redstone. Underneath this regular piston, we're going to place a block of wool, or whatever block you're using. And now we're going to place another regular piston beside it, and then we're going to place uh, three sticky pistons by three sticky pistons. As you can see here, three on top, three in the bottom, and then another three facing upwards. That's where your sandstone is going to go, and bring your sandstone all the way across. So, you're nearly there, you nearly have your whole build done. I'm just going to fill this in to show you how it actually works in a few minutes. There's one last step with connecting the redstone at the back with the uh, sticky pistons, which I'm going to show you right now. So, you get your uh, purple wool, and you make a pattern just like this, like I'm showing you. You place down your two um, redstone repeaters, you set that one to the fourth tick, and you set the other one to the third tick. Now you put a piece of redstone on the last one, and two pieces of redstone on top of those pieces of wool. And there you go, you're basically done. So, we're just gonna... So 
So guys, to see more content like what was in this video or what's on screen right now, make sure to subscribe to my channel and like, and also follow me on Twitter, uh, at JoshTheYouTuber, and just follow me there for more updates and stuff in my coming upcoming videos and stuff, and I'm sorry about the audio issue that I had with this video, this was a pre-recorded video for something else, but I hope you guys really enjoyed, and I'm going to have something really kick-ass and more advanced next week for you, so this has been Mr. Legacy guys, I'm out, see you on the dark side.